So my name is Jimmy Bangesh and I'm a spokesperson for the Council of Ex-Muslim of Britain. In the background you can see a lot of our members from the Council of Ex-Muslim of Britain. There are also um, individuals from Bangladesh who uh, are organised around a magazine called Boys Love and uh, it's a magazine for LGBT people. Um, within our community, homosexuality is really condemned in a way that actually we don't see so much in the West anymore. So we have 15 states that legislate for um, the execution of gay people and um, you know there are actual instances of executions taking place. So us being in the Gay Pride March is really about showing our solidarity with people who are LGBT and of Muslim heritage, whether that's in the UK, whether that's in Turkey, or whether that's across any other country across the world, we're marching to show our solidarity with them. And we're also marching to show our resistance to the Islamist narrative, which condemns ex-Muslims and condemns LGBT people. This is because they kill us in 15 states and they also call us kafir but we're taking back these words and we're going to make them our own. Just like how like Christian people and white gay people took back the word queer, we're taking back the word kafir, we'll own it, we're not afraid. Good my name, my name is Okay. Yeah, but I mean the context of this. <laughs> Good, bad, doing good. You're Whoa. looking gorgeous, guys. You're looking absolutely gorgeous. Whoa. You are. Happy Pride. Happy Pride. Keep those banners high. Keep those banners high. You tell them. Yeah, it's going good. It's going good. We're having a really lovely reception from people and it's so heartening to see people welcome us in this way and understand our message and support us fighting for gay rights. People have right, yeah, they absolutely, ladies and gentlemen, C-E-M-B, that's what I was looking for. Another wonderful cause, ladies and gentlemen, like I've said so many times today. Today is not just about celebrating exactly who we are, but it's about celebrating the people that don't have the luxury to do so. It's about being counted and saying, you know what, we've come a long way, but there's still a long way to go. I'm fairly sure that's in the finale now.
that was that was amazing, right? Yeah. That was it was literally amazing. We had so much support as we were walking through, and people really understood what was going on this time round. We had so many people on the mic talking about us and explaining what CEMB do, and really people empathising with what's happening with LGBT people in other countries, as well as LGBT people from the Muslim community in this country too.